This segment of the video is devoted to learning about the environment of the earth. Today's theme will be about the greenhouse effect. Greenhouse effect is a process in which the greenhouse gas traps the heat and warms the surface and troposphere of the earth. Without this effect, average temperature of earth will go down to minus 18 degrees celsius. So let's break down the basic of this phenomenon. First, when the sunlight hits the earth's atmosphere, water, or land, it is either reflected or absorbed as heat. But sun is not the only thing that's emitting light. Just like how a hot metal glows red, a rock, a living thing, even the air, and everything else also faintly glows. This is called a thermal radiation, where instead of absorbing light as heat, a matter releases heat as a light. Light from thermal radiation changes color and strength by temperature, so hotter matter lose heat quicker. The color of the light from thermal radiation changes from red-green to blue as temperature rises. But such colder than 525 degrees Celsius emits are invisible light called infrared radiation. Earth does not become too hot by sunlight, because it releases heat to the spaces are invisible light called infrared radiation. Calculation says the Earth should balance the heat from sunlight and loss of heat from thermal radiation at minus 18 degrees Celsius. But greenhouse gas increases that temperature to 15 degrees Celsius. That said, we will next move on to this greenhouse effect. Greenhouse gas reflects infrared radiation from Earth and prevent it from escaping, but that is a lie. Greenhouse gas actually absorbs infrared radiation and release it to a random direction. Because it absorbs infrared radiation, when Earth loses heat and release infrared light by thermal radiation, greenhouse gas absorbs that and release half to outer space and another half back to Earth. Greenhouse gas stands in a way of Earth's thermal radiation, so the Earth doesn't get too cold. Of course, if there's more gas, more light is absorbed and cause greater warming effect. It also absorbs infrared and ultraviolet ray from sun, so earth does not get too hot. However, it lets other light pass through so warming effect is stronger. In conclusion, greenhouse gas has two effects as followed. It makes surface of the earth warmer, and it keeps temperature of the surface of the earth stable. However, global warming is affecting the intensity of these effects. To summarize the segment, while the sunlight warms the earth, earth gets colder by releasing its own light called infrared radiation. However, because greenhouse gas absorbs and re-emits infrared radiation, some of that radiation returns back to earth and makes the earth warmer, while it also do the same to some of the sunlight, giving us some stable temperature. That would be the basic of how greenhouse effect works.